that you forgot to put in there. Yes, ye that forget God. To prove the sincerity of your love. For you know the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ that though he was rich, what? Yet for your sake. For your sake. He became poor. You know, you, you've got a lot of people in the church. Amen. And, you know, I, I thank God that mm -hmm. we have some working members in the church. Amen. Amen. And then you got some that's just sitting back. Amen. And they're sitting back drawing off of others' faithfulness. Amen. Amen. All right. And it ought not so to be. Amen. You shouldn't be dragging down, but you should be pushing up. All right. The elder said, you don't give for yourself, because see, that's selfishness. Mm -hmm. Well, I, I'm going to put it into the mutual savings because that, that's where I can get double back out. Well, see, you're getting from somebody else who put in also in to help you. Yes. Because you put a dollar in, you can get two dollars out. Amen. So where is the other dollar coming from? Somebody else had to put it there because you ain't giving but one. Mm -hmm. How we doing, church? Amen. Boy, didn't go there, get ready, because that table going to flow tonight. <laughs> We're trying to make a point here, church. You're robbing God. Amen. And you got the audacity to say, where in are we robbing him? Yeah. Ties and off. You curse with a curse. Amen. Listen, drop down a little bit. <clears throat> 13 verses what? No, 12 verse. For if there be first a what? A willing mind. Ah, that's all it takes. You know, you, 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 you don't have any kind of faith whatsoever that you can't trust God. Yeah. He said, you do for me, I'll do for you. All right. And you can't beat me doing I don't care how hard you try. You can't be God given. Yes. You can't beat him holding back either. That's now true. watch this. 12 verse says, For if there first be a willing mind, it is accepted according to that a man hath, and not according to that what? He hath not. God will make up the difference, church. Say, so Lord, you know, I don't have but 50 cents, but I'm going to give that 50 cents to you. Yes. Amen. Then God will turn around and give you 10 times 50. <clears throat> Amen. All right. And you know what you should do with that 10 times 50? You ought to give him a part of it. Yes. Oh, Lord, you done blessed me with it. I'm going to put it all in my fuel tank. <laughs> right. Don't forget about it. Watch this. Turn over to the uh, <clears throat> ninth chapter. Fifth verse. Therefore I thought it necessary to exalt the brethren that they would go before unto you and make up beforehand what? Your bounty. Your bounty. Read. Whereof you had noticed before. Read. That the same might be ready. Read. As a matter of bounty and Read. not of covetousness. Huh. You know, just because you see somebody else having something, then you want to have what they got. Get your own. Amen. Mm -hmm. Like I used to tell my son, he's sitting up there with his arms all around my wife. I said, go get your own. Oh, they love their mama now. I'm going to tell you that now. Oh, oh right. yeah. Say, go get your own. <clears throat> Amen. He's, he's 
finally went and got it. <laughs> yeah. Hey, Wonderful. Amen. Wonderful. Read, brother. But this I say. Listen now, here, here's, here's the point. Here's the point. I want you to beware. He which soweth sparingly. He which soweth sparingly. That means with a chinchy attitude. That means with a stingy, stingy spirit. Amen. And when people are stingy, they don't have no faith. They're trying to hold it all to themselves. Yeah. Lord said, I'll put a hole in your pocket. That's it, that's it. And you, you know, you can lose your keys so quickly and so easily. Yeah. Am I right, sister? <laughs> Some people walk around, you see my glasses? Anybody see my glasses? And they're sitting right up here. That's up. Sitting right on the top of their head and, and running around wondering, anybody see my glasses? See, God can bring these things to your remembrance. That's how great he is. Amen. But if you sow sparingly, ye shall reap also what? Sparingly. You ain't going to reap the benefits. You're not going to eat the good of the land. Because you're refusing and rebelling. Read. And he which sow bountifully ha! shall reap also. Bountifully. You know, I just gave God a raise. Amen. I, I did. I God just gave good. God a raise. Yeah. Wonderful. You know, he laid it on my heart to give him a raise. And it's something God wonderful. laid it on my heart to give him a raise. That's wonderful. <laughs> God is good. I ain't going to tell right? you what it is. I just gave God. I'll, I'll tell you one thing. It ain't that dollar. <laughs> Amen. He deserves it. I just gave him a raise. God is good. Amen. And he says, What now? He which soweth bountifully shall do what? Shall reap, reap also, also bountifully. bountifully. See, that's the way God is. Yes. Amen. Amen. You do for him, he'll do for you. That's it. See, and my doing is not necessarily for me, but it's for you. For I am making up your deficiencies. All right. Your negligence. All right. I'm putting it there so that you can have it, and you don't have the gumption enough to step up to the plate. No. God is good. Help me out now. Listen. Go over to uh, Proverbs. <clears throat> no, 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 no. Hold what you got. Because we, we got to put this in here. Seven verse. Turn over there. Look at that seven verse. Mm -hmm. Six verse. Talk about he that soweth sparingly shall reap also yeah. sparingly. He that soweth bountifully shall reap also bountifully. Seven verse said, every man according as he purpose, purpose, yeah. purpose yeah. in his heart. Do so what? Let, so let him give. So let him give. How? Not grudgingly. Ah. <laughs> I'm going to give it, but I don't know. Mm -hmm. I, don't, I want my money back. Yeah. <laughs> Amen. Get in trouble and the first one's come. Here it comes. Yeah. Pastor, can, can I get such, 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 such? I don't ask if you up on your offerings, you're up on your tithes, you're paying your sacrificial. I just go ahead on out of the kindness of my heart. That's it, wonderful. And sometimes I put a little extra in there. God is good. Because if you came to me for two hundred and twenty dollars, you need two hundred and twenty-one. Because <laughs> <laughs> it took you one dollar to get to me. All right. So I put a little extra in there. You ask for two twenty, I'll give you three hundred. Thank God for that. Not grudgingly. 